You don't know? Uh, look at me, I'm like, I'm like pimping myself to you to get a confession. I'm not my sister. Okay, I have nothing to confess. Don't play with me, Kyle. I don't know what Stacy told you, but I don't play women. Oh, no, 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 of course not. Who has time for that? You're too busy helping a tramp break up a happy family and keeping a secret that could save a boy's life. I know that Stacy is not the real donor. I don't know what you're talking yes, about. Yes, you do. And I can prove it. You changed the test results. Skylar and I, we swiped a DNA sample from Stacy and went to another lab. She couldn't donate to Shane any more than I could. Okay, well, so go tell her then. Not until I know who really saved my kid. You know who the real donor is and you won't tell, will you? And here I am, humiliating myself, trying to get the truth out of someone who doesn't give a damn. What if Shane gets sick again? Huh? How, how am I supposed to save him? Just tell me one thing. How do you live with yourself? It isn't easy. Wait! I'll tell you everything you want to know. For whatever you think of me, I do have feelings. And I can see how desperate you are. So you'll help me? That's why I got into this mess. No, it's not to help Stacy. Sure, she's hot and all, but come on, she's got a few screws loose. You think? I wanted to help your son. That's the whole reason I wanted to be a doctor. But the only way that I could help Shane was to keep the donor's name a secret. So, so Stacy could say it was her and break up Rex and me? I, I don't know anything about that, okay? I was keeping the donor's name a secret for another reason. Which was? It's complicated. But if you knew why, you'd understand. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, look, I, I want to help you. I really do. Okay, th this thing has gotten way out of hand. It's, it's turned into this big mess, okay, even for me. But before I help you, I gotta ask a favor of you. What? Rex's sister wants to throw me behind bars. Okay, she's pressing charges against me. What does that have to do with this? I'll tell you everything you wanna know, and then some. Just get Natalie to drop those charges against me. You know how much pull I have with Natalie? Zero. You haven't even tried yet, Gigi. She hates my guts because she thinks I cheated on her brother. She would not lift a finger to help me unless Rex was on my side. But if you tell me the truth, then I can kick Stacy to the curb where she belongs and Rex and I can get back together. Then we can go to Natalie and get her to drop the charges. I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna throw away the only leverage I have on the hope that Natalie's a forgiven person. You wanna find out everything I know? Then you gotta save me first. I have no interest in your love life. <laughs> Could have fooled me. You and Fish can do what you want. Just don't create a situation where there isn't one. As long as you stop putting a painting studio where there shouldn't be one. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's great. Now I have to go clean this off before my date. Better not be oil paint. So, what have you got planned? Uh, just some low key, some uh, little concert, maybe some ice cream. Flowers. Huh? You should get her flowers. Oh, and fish. You know, Layla has been given a raw deal by one too many guys. That includes you. So I'm only going to say this once. Treat her right. 
If not, you don't want to know what happens. Trust me. Um, I got it. I'll be a perfect gentleman. Good. You should get her roses. She likes the yellow ones. Thanks. What happened? What that son of a bitch do to you? Nothing. Couldn't go through with it. Oh. Well, good. I hated that plan. Tell me about it. Don't worry, we'll find another way to get Stacy. How? Stacy's not talking. And Kyle won't spill either. Unless I go to Natalie and beg her to drop these charges she has against him. You said that? Yeah, and I don't even know what that's about. So basically, I'm screwed. Uh, maybe not. I might have a, another option. 